This is the compound here. Last time on Road Warrior, we show you what a typical day in the RV life is all about. I run some errands on the Vespa, upload some videos, make some purchases at Walmart, and ride in the rain while Cardo has a spa day at home and explores the campground via mountain bike. We also hit up Bomb Boyette, one of the most amazing mountain bike trails, which also was only 30 minutes away. We ended the day with another beautiful sunset and moonrise and, of course, a bonfire. A big shout out to our newest patron, Nathan Jones. If you guys haven't already, check out patreon.com slash roadwarriorlife. You. Today, we're doing a little maintenance. What's up, Bruzy? The power is out at the campground, but changing the batteries in our RV lock, which, pretty simple to do. Pop two screws out and pop four new batteries in. Hopefully I have them. I got all kinds of crazy batteries here. Uh, let's see what I got. I got all kinds of different ones. Well, I was gonna do a little work on it. On the scooter? Okay, when you're done doing work, I can watch it. <laughs> oh, you're changing the batteries? Two. Four batteries, they're not the same. Let's see what we got. Sorry, babe, I forgot my glasses. Last time I'll be in here. Good job. <laughs> Heard a beep, so hopefully that means it works. Put that all the way on. Let's test. So, while I was taking care of some other things, Cardo was out there taking care of Juicy. We decided to take care of all of our babies this day. The Vespa, the KLR, Juicy, Warrior, they all got some love and attention. Kato had called the park and asked about the power being out. They said there's no reason it should be, so we flipped the breaker and boom, we had power. The Vespa had developed a lot of rust on the mirrors from all the salt spray, so I was just giving her a little TLC. So after flipping the breaker, we had power, but only for a short period of time. Seems there was a faulty breaker, and the park actually came out really quick and replaced the breaker for us. What are you doing? Attempting to make this mirror look prettier. Okay. We have rust all over. The mirror right there for that Vespa over there. Here we go. All right. Nice, Ta-da! Better than Rusty! <laughs> yeah. And we'll do the other one. Yeah, exactly. So we got Juicy cleaned up. Look at this rusty mirror. There you go, yeah. Pretty bad. Yeah, pretty bad. Trying to make the Vespa look nice because... Why? 
Well, just, it deserves it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That takes the rust right off. Juicy girl is looking fine. Look at the shine. Shine, 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 baby. Vespa, Eagle, Warrior. Everybody's looking good. Over the last couple of weeks, Ula had been going to the bathroom in the middle of the night, and she had never done this. She usually is able to hold it for a long period of time. So, Carla was giving her some extra love. We got addicted to the trails around here and we took full advantage of them. We were stoked, one of our best buds, Jeff, made the trip from South Florida and came and visited for the weekend. We are getting ready for a great ride. You. Yeah. Jeff's gonna ride the Vespa. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Vespa helmet. Yeah. Good to go. Uh huh. Come on, bro. Let's go, pee pee. Oh, she's ready to jump in the truck. She's so funny. What are we doing, Mister? Going on an epic adventure. You brought the wrong charger. I brought the wrong charger? I'll go get the new one. The other one. We're going on an epic adventure. Where are we going? We don't know yet. Oh, that's the best part. Okay. Um, we're walking the doggies before we go so we can have a long day out. And we have Jeff over here getting his bike ready to roll. Hello, Hello. mister. Ready to ride. Yes, sir. We're all well, we had a fire last night. Helmets, safety first, kiddos. And they're the doggies. Hi, babies. She's looking at the bike. Look at her. What are you doing, baby girl? Oh, my goodness. She makes it impossible. <laughs> it's like either pet me or pet me. You have two options. Kato and I were super pumped to hang out with Jeff. It had been nearly five months without seeing any of our good friends. Think, yeah, they're know, just on Facebook. You know, enjoying the day on Facebook, <laughs> This you know. is how I spend a day. Yeah. Instead of writing, they're like on Facebook and Instagram yeah. and who knows what else. <laughs> Getting directions. <laughs> yeah, it'd be so cool if you can just put in like... You need the to know where to go. I think it's... Tail of the gecko. So after a late breakfast, we found a trail called Tale of the Gecko when we were off. Shall we begin? Let's begin now. And this is our cool part of the journey. Hello, mister. <laughs> I'm gonna get you on camera many, many times today. Hope you're comfortable with that. <laughs>
After a beautiful 50 miles, we stop on the side of the road to look at directions and take a little pee break. So I had to use the restroom and um, I had to uh, climb up this thing over here. So. Check you guys out. Hello, hello, Papa. Hello, Papa Chito. Oh my goodness, hello. You guys like me better with the helmet. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> <laughs> This is not a drill. Repeat, this is not a drill. Is that all you got? Let's begin. So after about 75 miles of country roads, we stop for a bite to eat before heading over to St. Pete. So while I was enjoying a really nice and peaceful lunch, I got a call from my sister who was in Miami, and her car had somehow rolled into one of the gates at a really nice hotel. Here's her friends who she called who had a Jaguar and some chains and they were trying to pull it out. <laughs> what if we, uh, we need a bigger... Comment below if you think the Jag got it out. No. Oh.
This is the compound here. Just got done with a 160 mile, 170 mile bike ride with Jeff and Cardo. Had an awesome trip. Pretty sweet roads. Big thanks for tuning in to another episode of Road Warrior. Guys, we love and appreciate your support. Remember, if you like, if you share, if you subscribe, that all helps support our journey. And click on those affiliate links for Amazon. When you shop, we get paid a tiny percentage, and we greatly appreciate it. Tune in next week as we have some more fun with Jeff. You!